This is definitely robbing. Bees going into multiple, looking for multiple entrances, and uh, there's an aggressive fight going on at the front door here. But mostly they're going in the back. They're trying to get in the back. There's an opening in the back. All right, I gotta close this up. All right, I just closed up the back hole really tight. There's definitely foreign bees that are trying to get in the back. I gotta close up the entrance. Yeah, they're, they're fighting. They're trying to get in the cracks in the back here. But I just cinched down the lid really tight. This is a battle. This is definitely something serious happening to the hive. This little back of the flow hive, there's a, a little rear, there's a little rear thing right up here that I had to open for ventilation, but it's, it's like a half inch wide space. And I had it open for the last couple days to let heat out. And looks like some other bees found that hole and they are going crazy. So this is definitely what robbing looks like. trying to find their way in every which way. All right, I don't know if this is a good idea, but I'm not wearing any gear. I just was out for a walk and I came up here, but I'm gonna try and put, I don't know if this is a good idea. I wanna try and block the entrance. There's a lot of bees going in the hive and I don't know if they're my bees or someone else's bees. Put the, I closed the hole. There's a serious frenzy going on at the opening now. And I don't know if that's my bees trying to get back in or if it's the other bees trying to get in but it is very aggressive. All right, I closed, up, I closed up all the entrances that I could close, and I'm just gonna let them hang out for a little while, I guess. Hopefully these robber bees will find another place to go. I hope that's the right thing to do. Just close up all the entrances. I know there's foreign bees inside the hive, and they're probably getting hammered by everyone inside. But I think that's better than letting all these uh, other ones rush in. 
So I'm just gonna leave that shut for now. All right, these, I just gave them about 15 minutes and I'm coming back in to just have a look and things are much more calm, whoa. Still a little bit trying to get in there, but see, now they're going in the bottom. Yeah. Trying to get in the bottom. Yeah, they are like, they're up trying to get through the screen. Wow. All right. I'm gonna open this up just a little bit so that my bees can get in if they want to. But I'm gonna leave it just a little, little opening. There we go. Get, get hit, all right. All right, that's just one, like one bee at a time. Yeah, I don't know who's rushing out of the hive now, if that's my bees or if that's the ones that are the foreign bees. But now they just have a much smaller area to defend. So hopefully, you know, they hopefully they're keeping them out of the bottom of the hive. bees are exhausted. I don't think some of, I think some of them can fit through the bottom screen but I I don't think all of them can. The smaller bees can fit through that screen but the larger bees can't and it looks like they're uh, they're turning away. They're not all rushing in. They're they're kind of going in and then coming back out because they can't get through. All right, well, I think I solved the problem. I, I definitely should not have had that back flow hive opening open. This little thing here at the top is a, a little door that you can pull out uh, when you go to activate your flow frames. It's where you put the key to turn the key to get the honey out. The honey comes out of this door but that is the, the slot you open to get to put the key in to turn. And it was just an, about a half inch opening up there. And during these really hot days we've been having, I, I've been opening that up to let heat escape from the hive. And it just is too big of a hole. So I won't do that again. But it is... Uh, it's evening time, it's sun is going down, so I think I'm gonna let the bees, you know, fend for themselves now. So there's about a half inch hole here now, and hopefully that is a, a small enough opening that my bees can fend for themselves for the night. This is way, way calmer than it was 15 minutes ago. So I think the, uh, the robber bees have gotten discouraged they're probably going to be going home soon. All right, hopefully uh, they didn't do too much damage. And I've learned yet another lesson in beekeeping. Thanks for watching.